Hi 6th graders, this is your science teacher in YD Mangos. Welcome to our new video lesson and I'm inviting everyone let's work together, do our best to learn as much as we can. Let's have fun as we explore the amazing world of science. Let's do this! Well, you have learned from the previous lesson that planets differ in many characteristics such as their average temperature and distance from the Sun. Now, the solar system is made up of the eight planets that orbit the Sun. Welcome to our last video lesson in this school year in science planet in the solar system which aims to construct a model of the solar system from learner's pocket quarter four week seven to eight let's go we will have a presentation on the relative distance and size of the planets one by one we're going to have the distance from the sun and the equatorial diameter in kilometer or the planet size. Are you ready, six graders? If you are ready now, let us have this presentation. Mercury. It has a distance from the sun 58 million kilometer with the planet size 4880 kilometer. This is Mercury. The second one is Venus. Venus has a distance from the Sun 108 million kilometer with planet size 12,104 kilometer. Once again, this is Venus. The third one is our very own Earth. The Earth has 149 million kilometer distance from the Sun and the planet size is 12,750 kilometer. So this is our very own Earth. The fourth one is Mars with 227 million kilometer distance from the Sun an equatorial diameter of 6,788 kilometer. This is the fourth one called Planet Mars. The fifth in the outer planets is Jupiter with 774 million kilometer distance from the Sun and equatorial diameter of 142,984 kilometer. So this is Jupiter. It is followed by Saturn. Saturn has a distance from the Sun of 1.4 billion kilometer and equatorial diameter of 12536 kilometer. So this is Saturn. The next one is Uranus with 2.9 billion kilometer distance from the Sun and with equatorial diameter of 51,118 kilometer. So this is the second to the last planet, Uranus. And the last planet is Neptune with a distance from the Sun of 4.5 billion kilometer with equatorial diameter of 49,500, I mean, 532 kilometer. So this is the last planet, Neptune. All right, so to sum it up, let us have the planets Mercury to Neptune with distance from the Sun and the planet size. This is based from our leap in science for quarter four, week seven to eight. All right, please take note of this. Now, we are ready for the learning task one. Ding, ding, ding. Let's go. 
The directions are complete the table by converting the measured distance of planets into centimeters. Using the scale, 1 centimeter is equal to 10 million kilometers. Write your answer on your answer sheets. Make use of the following formula as an example in converting the distance into the given scale. So this is an example computation of distance of Mercury. Example, scale distance is equal to distance from the sun over 10 million kilometer times 1 centimeter. It is equals to 58,000 million kilometer over one all right so 10 million kilometer all right so we have the phrase example 5.8 centimeter that is an example answer so i'll be giving you enough time to answer this Good luck! Be guided with our formula, distance from the sun, over 10 million kilometer times 1 centimeter. And now, if you are done with writing your answers, you are ready with checking. So here is our suggested answers. So please be guided. Congratulations if you got the perfect score for this learning task one. Congratulations. And now, we are ready for learning task two. Learning task two goes like this. Arrange the planets in the increasing order by placing one on the planet which corresponds to the least and eight on the planet which corresponds to the most. Based on the given properties, column number one is given as an example. So it's very easy, right? All you have to do is to rank them according to the least to the most. So the first column has been done for you orbit or period from mercury to neptune so i'll be giving you enough time you can refer to your leap in science quarter four, week six for your reference good luck everyone ding, ding, ding. again be guided by our leap Quarter four, week six. All right. Let's proceed with checking. Let's check your work. Here is our guided answers. Now check your own answers. So these are the answers for the size, distance from the sun, temperature and number of moons this is their ranking all right so are you done with this good job after doing the two learning tasks now we are ready for learning task three the direction is complete the table by converting the measured size of planets into centimeters using the scale 1 centimeter equals 1,000 kilometer. Write your answer on your answer sheets and make use of the following formula as an example of converting the size into the given scale. So this is the sample computation for a scale size equals to planet size over 1,000 kilometer times 1 centimeter. So the planet Mercury has a planet size of 4,880 kilometer over 1,000 kilometer times 1 centimeter. So we have a scale size of 4.88 centimeters. So this is our answer for the first item. Ding, ding, ding. All right. So 
All we have to do is to compute for the scaled size in two centimeters. So we have the planet's Mercury to Neptune. The planet size is given or the planet sizes are given or the equatorial diameter in kilometer. All you have to do is to solve for the scaled size in two centimeters. Good luck guys! Ding, ding, ding. I'll be giving you enough time to answer this. Don't forget to use the correct formula in getting the scale size into centimeters. So you are like mathematicians for today's video in science, right? All right, if you are done, now let's check. Get your checking pen now. Let's see if you got the correct answer. All right, so these are the answers for the scale size in two centimeters from Mercury to Neptune. Check your own work. And congratulations if you got the passing score or you got the correct scores in this learning task. Now we are in our last learning task, which is learning task four. Using any available materials from home, make your own model of the solar system. The following are the suggested color and size of the planet. So get some available materials from the kitchen at home, from your room. And now we're going to make your own model of the solar system. But first, make sure that you will have the color yellow for the sun with 25 centimeter and for the inner planets like the mercury color it orange with three centimeter venus yellow five centimeter earth blue five centimeter and mars red four centimeter and for the outer planets you're gonna have jupiter color it brownish with a red spot and with the uh, size of 10 centimeter for saturn color it yellow with red ring with 10 centimeter for uranus green 8 centimeter and for the last planet neptune color it blue with 8 centimeter scaled size all right so this is our suggested color and size of the planets make sure that you will be guided by the rubric in assessing learners individual model of the solar system to get 10 points okay so this is our sample make sure that you will follow the color and the sizes okay congratulations in advance i know you can do this congratulations once again sixth graders our video lesson is adapted, of course, from our learner's packet in Science 6, quarter 4, week 7 to 8. If you have questions, just type them in the comment section. Congratulations, 6th graders! You are done with the last leap in science for the whole school year. So, again... For all your questions, I will be reading them in the comment section. Congratulations once again. Your teacher in science is very proud of you.